and welcome to DS Tech Mirror. Today, we will be seeing how we can extract user information from the current logged user details in Power Apps. So for that, let me create a blank canvas app. I'm taking the tablet layout. And in the tablet layout, I'm not going to select any other uh, form or gallery, but I'm going to skip this. So here, in order to fetch the current logged in user, I am going to create few labels. So let me create this label as an employee information. So I am going to type employee name. I'll be making this as bold, control B, adding another text field, text label. Uh, right now, I'm going to leave it as it is. And again, I'm going to add another label, which says email address making it as bold again another text label to hold the email address again from the media I'm going to select image in order to retrieve the logged in user uh, user profile image so on clicking of the image i can see it is having a sample image and the values are having sample text so how can we fetch the currently logged in user details you can see from here in this user detail i'm having an image the currently logged in user is having an image it he, it is having a full name and email address right and we'll be fetching these information and in order to fetch these information from power apps power apps has provided us a special function called user function so using this user function we will be able to fetch these three basic details from the currently logged in user when you call this function you can retrieve three values and in order to retrieve the three values you have to use dot over here and you can see from the intelligence we will be able to fetch email full name and image so right now i'm going to click full name and the full name will be appearing over here similarly for the address user function dot email address and the address will be retrieved and for the image user function dot image so when you load this power app form when you create this power app form and when you load it with different logged in users the currently logged in users information will be extracted using the special function that we have seen today that is the user function and in that user function we will be able to fetch only three user profile details namely full name of that currently logged in user email address and the profile image so there are at times when we need to extract more further information from the currently logged in user like the country name, office, location and even his or her manager account details. So in order to fetch further information from the currently logged in user, we have to add a data source a special data source and then using a filter query we will be able to fetch those extra information 
So we will be seeing how we can fetch these extra intonation in the next video. That is all for today's video and in this video we have seen how to fetch the basic user intonation from the currently loaded user. Thanks for watching. Much love, keep learning.